dolls welcome back to the channel <laughs> so i last left off with you all <clears throat> i uploaded let me take this off i uploaded a rainbow shop aka blue bag boutique video and i said in that video how i'm knee deep and how i'm out of breath because if y'all just saw in that clip i was trying to get out the subway but anyway i'm knee deep and home innovation and I wasn't sure if that was anything y'all might be interested in seeing because I'm just running around picking out new kitchen appliances flooring cabinets and all the shebang bang and so many of you was like no glam excuse me where's my manners by the way if you happen to be a newbie passing through seeing me for the very first time welcome to the channel <laughs> my name is glam and in this video i'm just sharing my renovation work with you all at least the process that is um this channel is all about hair beauty fashion a little bit of lifestyle so i do encourage you to hit that subscribe button turn on your bell notifications for you will never miss an upload as i was saying uh so many of you expressed the interest in seeing this whole process since it's part of my lifestyle or what i'm currently doing i figured to share with you all so right now i'm in kitchen design yes i'm coming here to pick out my cabinets for my kitchen and i'm gonna show you all what it's looking like made it back i'm here to see john he's helping design my new kitchen so excited and i'm gonna pick out the uh cabinets today gotta give him a deposit contractors in play he starts monday so you all gonna start seeing a whole lot of behind the scenes work going on i will show you the before you know what the kitchen currently is looking like but wait <laughs> until you see the after <laughs> okay so let me show you what we're working with so far it don't look like much to you all right now. It's going to look a little strange, but this is the refrigerator, which is going to be a uh, Sub-Zero Pro. These will be the cabinets, the countertop, the dishwasher, the sink, whatnot, new baseboards. Over here is the second part to my kitchen, which is the cabinets right here. You have your microwave, your stove, which is the, um, what's the stove, babe? LG? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll tell you all about it later, but these are the cabinets and whatnot. So this is what we're working with. And uh, I'm going to show you what the actual sample of the cabinet system is going to be looking like. So, I am a pen bandit. <laughs> I've been, I've been known to do that. So, I believe I went with this one here. Mm -hmm. I forget the countertop. Yes, that's why I was trying to remember too. The countertop. I know the cabinet was like. Yeah. Gosh. I should have wrote it down. What are you looking for? Was there a the, picture before? Previously? The, uh, yeah, well, I know which one it is because I took the snapshots of it. Okay. Shape, um, uh, that had the, I had a little bit of it. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, that one. Exactly. This is the one? Yes. Okay. Now, mm -hmm. I don't know the, the floor amount in the kitchen. Okay. But the rest you have, I remember last time. Yeah. Because right? he's going to do the floors all throughout. Okay. Um, now, the, I'm working with Juan. Okay, that's good. He's good. He's he good suggested. Yeah that even with the measurements you have for the kitchen, mm -hmm. because he's building out adjacent to it, the closet, which means he needs to extend the kitchen, oh, okay. that perhaps he should send you the new, the new measurements for the accuracy. Okay, the gotcha. I can work with that. So safely, can we still go with the later design as far as the, the measurements, the measurements and then I now. can leave the deposit? And then we can adjust accordingly depending on Okay, so I wanna do that. Okay, and sorry, uh, which cabinet? I mean, I'm, I'm gonna find it right now. Okay. Yes, it was a Sagittarius polish one. Mm -hmm. 
same as this, but within the 12 by 24. So is this one? Uh, I thought this had more grade. Oh, no, the one that you picked was that one there. This is a good one. Okay, yes, yes. Perfect. Okay. 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 So this is partial of the floor. Yes. And then there was also the 12 by 24 tile, which was the one on the bottom there. Uh -huh. Which one? That was a polished version. And You'll hold on to it. Uh huh. And this will be the countertop. That will be the countertop. Which okay. matches that perfectly. Okay, just so I can give you all a close up. This is going to be the floor, the shape and design, which I'm going to do an insert where you can see the design I'm going for, as well as this will now be my countertop and cabinets. I need to pick out hardware. So, okay. I'm guessing it'll go over, over here by the wall. little corner. Okay. Yeah, so right. this might be half a cabinet. Half a cabinet? Okay, just give me the specs. I'll update it and I'll update the, the pricing too. Oh, okay. okay. I need no wine. <laughs> I believe you did mention that before, but we didn't we, we didn't have enough space to put it here. Mm -hmm. And you were thinking about doing it here, but that wasn't sure yet. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah. So if not later on today, tomorrow, I'll email you for that um, wine. Okay. So I think. Okay. Okay. So you got the text with the uh, handles. Oh, let me set that up right now. Oh, you got my phone. <laughs> oh my God. So, as I was saying, the last time y'all saw me, I was with the kitchen designs, and while I was sitting there, I had to pick out my sink, and it's an under mount sink, meaning the um, countertop is over the sink as opposed to the sink being over on top of the countertop. It'll all make sense. I'll show that to you a little bit later. But in the meantime, the sink that is, I'll show it to you a little bit later. In the meantime, I wanted to unbox this. <laughs> this is so exciting that I'm trying my best to uh, here we go. Oh, it's a box within a box. Amazon be doing the most. Jeez. Okay. Now, the beauty about this sink is called a workstation sink. And it's a single bowl, undermount sink, workstation, kitchen sink. Now, when they say workstation, um, the sink itself, you can do prep on the sink. It could be a sink for you to wash dishes. It could be a uh, for your if you use in a restaurant like a, a what they call that a, a, a sous chef. Rev. Rev don't like to speak when I be talking to him. You know, the camera. I don't know why. Make it seem like I'm talking to myself. You're talking to your subscribers. Yeah, but I just asked you a question, babe. I mean, I don't know. You don't know what a sous chef is? I know what a sous chef is, is but that had nothing to do with the chef? sink. His son is a sous chef. Okay. 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 Okay
but look it has one two and three the actual drain the protector for debris so your thing don't get clogged that's the that's the the bee the bee trap bee trap that's what it's called De and what's the debris first debris trap oh debris and what's the wow. first thing up here that's just the drain no the, the bottom is the drain right you just so oh, thing the is the drain the whole the thing is the drain this is the thing that stops water and inside of that is the, the it's the, not even allowing me to get it open you just pull it up. Oh, there we go. And that's the oh. debris trap. The debris trap. Oh, but it has another debris trap down there. No, it doesn't. That's not a debris trap. That's just a drain. This okay. is going to trap. This is stopping all particles. That's why it has a handle. Okay. So you put it like that, and whatever gets caught gets caught in this basket, you take that, you dump it out. So then I'm going to keep this in here at all times. Yes, you keep that in there. And this all is time. just the top. That's the top. For when I want to stop it up. There you go. Bang. Okay. All right. We're working with it, dolls. We're working with it. You know? So that's that. Dishes or something. We can just. Ooh, this is a two for one video. Because this is actually an unboxing for this particular model of sink, which I'm going to make in a secondary video. But <laughs> this is that. You open like this, and it will sit there. So when I do dishes, let's say this is my sink. I can just lay the dish, you know, here, or prep work too, right? Mm -hmm. Still for like the meats and stuff. Mm -hmm. We'll figure it out. It's a whole nother day, dolls. A whole nother day. And I'm at my favorite place. Lowe's. <laughs> so, I'm at Lowe's today because I need to find a wine cellar. And um, I seen one on their website and i decided to come in store you know to get a visual to see what it's looking like up close and personal so i can add it into the kitchen so excited the goal is only to get the wine cellar but of course you know i'm going to look at other things so i'm going to take you along with me because like i said y'all want interested in seeing my journey on this new remodel so let's go here we go. Welcome to Lowe's. So we in here. Oh, what they got going? In-home consultations. Oh, I can look at the um the window treatments. I'm gonna check out the window treatments too. Oh, this is nice. I'm already getting sidetracked. That lights up. Look at that. Well, that lights up. I'm already getting sidetracked. This will look cute. No, that's not what I'm here for. Let me keep going. But wait a minute, that do look nice. Anyway. So everyone, I'm with my mother. She don't want to be on camera per usual. I'm also going to do a little bit of promo and while I'm in here. I'm going to show you what I mean by that. But uh, when I find the wine cellars, I can uh, come back and show you which ones I'm about to go with. Okay, I found them. These are the wine cellars. So here's the wine cellars. Not quite what I'm looking for. Cause I need a skinny one like that, but I need a skinny one. And uh, not bad. What's 249? What is 249? See babe, I don't know if this is that. That wine cellar right here but ideally I would want a half of one but if I got to take the bigger one I'm just gonna have to take the bigger one I may have to order it right let's see dolls let's see what we come up with can I tell you all the most embarrassing thing so I come all the way up here. Mind you, I'm way out from my residency. But anyway, I didn't even have my wallet on me. I'm riding around, no wallet, no ID, no, no driver's license, no money. Thankfully, Rev, the hubs, was with me. He had to use his car to get us to get the wine cellar. So mission still accomplished. I got the wine cellar, but now I need to get home. We still got to go by Apple because he needs to get an ear tag. So now what I need to do is go ahead and get this back. I got it. Right here. 
gonna take it home. So excited. Look at her. So excited. And it was on sale. No way was I gonna leave her behind. Take her on home. Go by Apple first. Wait a minute. Go by Apple first. Now you knew I was getting a wine cellar. But why didn't you clear out your trunk? Well, Let me show you. Look at this. That's not going to fit in there. Let me help with this. I'm going to get the camera. Hey dog. It's a whole nother day. And can you believe that when I last left off with you all, I um was getting the wine cellar from Lowe's. Well, when I got home with it, I didn't change my mind. But you know what that what happens? When you don't follow your first initial instinct and you let someone else's input derail your, your thoughts of action, it just irritates me. So I came back. And then my mom was like, oh, why don't we just go to Jersey so I can go to Walmart and blah, blah, blah. And I was like, eh, okay, well, Lowe's is next to Walmart. Only for me to get out here to Jersey because today technically is Easter. Lowe's is closed, but Walmart is open. Dude, it's in the bag. Now she's yelling and screaming that she can't find her junior mints, which I know I put the bag right here. Now, when I find them right here, where's that? Oh. Oh. Put it on the side. Oh. So, anyway, out here at Walmart, and I realize I also need to close this vlog off. So, I'm going to take y'all with me into Walmart because I'm always good for uh, promoing my business. And I'm going to show you all how I do that from time to time. Coming? You locked it? Oh, I got to lock the car door. Let me just Hold on. I gotta lock the car door. Oh my gosh. Look, she carries my keychain. Proud supporter of Miss Glamour Addict Cosmetics. I know she only bought it, so she I can't say she didn't buy any of my things. Because she went on the website and ordered it. It is available on the website, by the way. That is the Rich Lips Collection. Um, designer Lip Gloss Collection. Anyhow. Yo, I'm taking that card. Well, take this cart then. And when I promo my business, I'm going to show y'all what I be doing. You know, I, I unapologetically <laughs> promote my business by any means necessary. So, with that being said, let's head in here. As I pick things up, I'm going to show you how I unapologetically promo my business. Let's go. Okay, so remember I was just saying how um, unapologetically I be promoting my business. So, here's what I do. I have my business cards, which is like this, but they promo cards. They got a special discount code uh, that helps me to know where my marketing and uh, buyers is coming from. So, right now, I'm in the baby aisle. And oftentimes, new parents, they wrapped up in the sense, well, new parents, existing parents, parents in general, they so consumed by their kid that I created a card. Hold on. Let me get it for you. That says, nothing haunts us like the things we didn't buy, meaning what you didn't buy for yourself. So what I tend to do is, I take something like, let me see. Is this one? Yep. I take something like this. I can see this right here. Fisher Price. Okay, that's Fisher Price. And I'm going to take my card. And I'm going to stick it. down in there voila so now let's go like this so now whoever the parent might be that will buy this when they open it and they take everything out to try to put this together they're gonna find my card in here and hopefully it'll be a new mom and she might be curious enough or a new parent that might be curious enough to say well what haunts me for the things I didn't buy and will literally go to my website and when they get to my website, they may just buy 
that's something so i do that in the baby aisles i do that in the beauty aisles because these companies they already pay for their marketing they already pay to get on their show i'm just piggybacking off of what they already got going so let me finish promoing and um as i put stuff in the car oh Child. yeah i'm promoing she's asking me what i'm doing yeah. i don't know what they were playing just now but there was a lot of copyright infringement oh, yeah. going on uh, so finish shopping in walmart i didn't know yeah oh you did yeah i ain't bothered showing what the process or whatever it was i was getting because Super stressed out in there. I can't. I cannot. Why are you throwing it in the token? In the I cannot. This is why I'll do Instacart or whatever the case may be. But um, do any do any of you when you go food shopping, do you start consuming some of like do you buy stuff that I'm not gonna pay for? I put it on our side. No, no, no. I was gonna ask you, do you buy or do they buy food that like as soon as you come out the supermarket you can start eating? Yeah, you don't know, like to while they in there. Yeah. I drank while I was in there. I had a melon mountain. Drink. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it's right there. Well, I brought this uh, snack tray. <laughs> snack tray. And then I got my um, seafood salad. Oh, yeah. yeah. And I'm going to use the crackers. That. I'm hungry, man. And I'm not going to um, Wendy's over there. All right, have a good day. I'm going to eat the, um, the crackers with the seafood salad. Something to drink. Oh, okay. And he's starting to play that music again. Anyway, this concludes the video. Thank you all for taking the time to watch this video. I'll be sure to share more behind the scenes of what's going on in the lifestyle. Now that I'm getting the renovations done, the contract is coming in on Monday. Y'all gonna see the breakdown of the old kitchen to the transformation to the new kitchen and the flooring and stuff. Why is that man yelling? Seriously, huh? A taxi. Oh, seriously. Thank you all for taking time to watch this video. I'm going to go and finish my salad, but I will see you all in another video. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's the oil. I'll see you all in another video again shortly. Later, dolls. Mm. That's the oil.